morning, buddy. It's time to get up. There's adventuring to be done. Hey, lazy. You're a lazy dog. Come on, let's go. Come on. I think this is the perfect spot, guys, to set up some feeders for the winter. Um, I run trail cameras right here in this clearing, so I'm up here quite a bit with Gage. And we're throwing other food for the foxes and the fisher and the martens. So let's get some bird stuff set up. And that'll just give me another excuse to make sure I come up here every couple of days and feed the birds. And I brought two kinds of seed mixed together here. We're gonna throw some bread around on the ground. And I've actually ordered a hunting blind uh, that I want to use for bird photography. I've got some canvas that I'm going to throw over top of it and we're going to start utilizing that, moving that around the property and down at the river and see if we can get birds a little easier once they get accustomed to a hunting blind, especially the wood ducks in the spring. Those guys are very finicky and I've never had great luck. So this next spring, you know, four or five months from now, that's what I want to do is utilize a hunting blind. But throughout the winter, we'll use it here on the property and just to get things coming in all the time, we'll set up some feeders for now. No, <laughs> no, that's not, hey, <laughs> Gage, no, <laughs> one, hey, hey, sit, down, down, stay, 
stay. So what you're looking for when you want to set up these feeders is an open spot behind you where you can put your blind close enough, you know, 10-15 feet. Some of these birds are going to be tiny. The second thing is that these trees have lots of perches for birds to land in. I don't want to take pictures of them sitting on the edge of the feeders. I want to take pictures of the birds as they come in and land on the branches all around and it looks very natural. Um, you know, and a side effect of this is that by bringing in these little songbirds or winter birds, chickadees and nuthatches and whatever else, you're going to bring in bigger birds of prey that are going to try to feed on these guys. Unfortunately, that's the way of it. So you may get some shots and you need to have places for bigger birds, hawks and things to land as well.